Um, one of the, the main issues which has created a, a whole school initiative in terms of developing literacy and reading is the statistics that we all know in terms of the amount of pupils that are going into secondary schools with reading ages which are lower than their chronological ages. 40% of pupils across Wales are going into secondary schools uh, in this way. And in terms of our catchment here at Bayslake, we are typical in terms of the fact that the statistics from our reading tests that we do do echo those national statistics. And when you're looking at those kind of statistics, which are then reinforced with uh, the kind of directives we're getting from Welsh Government and PISA test results, you have to be aware that you can't tackle literacy in terms of intervention like uh, perhaps we had done previously. You have to look at literacy in terms of adjusting the pedagogy that you have in the school and in terms of adjusting the policies that you have in the school. Um, that's how it works from a, that's how it's worked in terms of our strategic planning in terms of literacy. But also I think the most important element of this is that when you're talking about literacy and reading, you're talking about the key skill that is going to enhance pupils' life skills, their employability skills, their ability to access their curriculums, access their exams, the kind of things that they're measured on when they go into the wider world. So we actually have a very clear responsibility in terms of pupils to develop their, their literacy skills, as well as looking at things like statistics. Um, one of the things which attracted us, in fact, to the, the triple literacy uh, project was the fact that it's one of the projects which looks at literacy as a, as a skill, which is how very much we're trying to look at literacy here in Bayslake. Um, when you start looking at literacy as a skill and you start breaking it down into the components of how pupils access their texts and how they achieve meaning from a text, then you start looking at literacy in a way which can very easily be spread out across several subjects and you start looking at a way where um, teachers can take certain strands of it and form a very cohesive literacy model which pupils can um, see as they move throughout their entire curriculum. The triple literacy bid, which has worked across uh, Welsh, French and English, has started that project rolling really, where the teachers have broken literacy down into its key elements and then pupils have been subject to different, well to the same rather, literacy strategies in all sorts of different subjects. And the real way I think to improve pupils' literacy, as I said, isn't through that um, intervention, it's through showing them that literacy is something which happens in every single subject and it's a skill which they can develop in the way that we've previously had success developing their thinking skills. Um, from that, this is going to go on to then inform our whole school literacy project, uh, inferring, synthesising, analysing, skimming and scanning and predicting. These are all the kind of phrases that teachers across the whole school will be using that will be um, emerging from the schemes of work across Key Stage 3 over the next couple of years in all subjects so that pupils can see then that literacy is something which actually they are using in every single lesson and they're using, it, they're using the same skills in different ways and we think that's the model which will best allow pupils to be in situations where they are able to interpret what exam questions are asking. They're able to go into a job and uh, select a document and take from it what they need to. The small grant we received from Silk Cymru has has really been instrumental really in allowing us to get this off the ground in that it has allowed teachers to work together to form PLCs, to have people um, taken perhaps out of timetable to work together, to produce resources. We can see that this is having a significant impact on pupil attainment. Um, from a whole school perspective though, what's, what we're personally, what we're really excited about is the idea that when you stop pupils at the moment and you have a chat with them about their literacy, they're able to deconstruct literacy and have a conversation with you in a way which, where they uh, talk about the strategies that they use and the lessons that they've used and what's helped them, what tactics they've used and what's helped them access texts. All of those things they can do in a way which they previously wouldn't have been able to do. So you can have very informed conversation with pupils in a way where they can deconstruct their literacy in a way which they previously wouldn't have been able to. And that understanding and that cross-curricular understanding which they're developing is, from our perspective, what we're really trying to achieve here at Bayslake.